Hello, and welcome back to my playthrough of Final Fantasy VI Advance. In this episode, I will be going through South Figaro Cave and get out to the other end where I will explore and go through and rest in South Figaro. Go up to the little hut at the top, take a chocobo over to Mount Colts, I believe it's called. Go through there. And I'll end the episode once I get just outside the return of hideout. So without further ado, it's time to get going. King Edgar, where are you headed, sire? Through the cave and eastward to South Figaro. We will then make for the return of headquarters in the north. Return to the castle and pass the word along. Understood, sire. Take care. <clears throat> so yes, in we go. Oh wow, great battle straight away. Hornet and Rock. Oh, waiting for Edgar's attack. There we go, auto crossbow. Do, 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 do. Lovely. I mean, he, he can just clean house, really. Anyway, 5, 7, and 8. As long as she gets to. Well, if ever gets to 7, by the time I'm out of here, I'll be fine. Or should be fine at least. Anyway, up here you go across, there's like a bridge, and you get to a chest. Oh dear. Oh lovely. Tools, auto crossbow. Probably should have made Terror attack one of the other Fopers. Because if I remember rightly. Yeah, an auto crossbow is not enough, but one attack on the Foper is enough. So anyway, I was going to say that should have been enough. She might even be able to get to level 8 by this point, I'm not sure. I mean, that, that might be a bit of a stretch, but 7's obviously not out of reach. Anyway, oh, the same battle again. Tools, auto crossbow, and I can just attack whoever now because, you know... Won't really change anyway. Lovely. I guess that's good for experience. And I mean, Terra should have enough MP for it anyway. I mean, how much has she got at the moment? That'll do. What way do I want to go? I think this is dead end, isn't it? Yeah, that is. Thought so. Ooh, rock again. I mean, Edgar, I mean, he's, al he's already amazing at this point. Like, like. There you go. As I said, when he gets the drill, it only attacks one enemy, but it deals mega damage. And then there's the secret chainsaw you can get, and I think the time on the clock that you need to, like, set is something like... I think it's like 12 is the hour, 10 is the minute. Something like 50 is the second, I'm not sure though. Anyway, well, that works out nicely. There we go. So, you want, once you learn <coughs> the basics of all the characters that you get in this game, it, it's relatively fine. Obviously, there are still bits that can be difficult. Obviously, not quite yet, because it hasn't got to those points. Anyway. There's a certain enemy I haven't seen in here yet. I thought it's called already, but it's like the purple stingray enemy I actually mentioned about earlier. Um, not on the video, of course, but yeah, anyway. Let's go this way, because I'm sure there is... A, yep, I was about to say, I'm sure there's a chest. Might as well explore the full extent. Obviously, dungeon. Oh, dear. Back attack. I don't think that affects Edgar's auto crossbow. We'll see. Because it's a tool, I don't think it does now. Lovely. Phoenix down. Right, so that's everything done. And this part of the dungeon, that's basically most of the dungeon done, I think. You know, lovely hornets again. Might have to heal up once. But that'll be fine. <clears throat> there is no boss here anyway, but yeah, anyway. 
Level seven. That should do. Because now it'll get to the point where it will take a few battles to level up in this dungeon. And there's no need for that. There's no need for grinding yet. Anyway. Here's the exit. And look at that five minute. And do I wanna go I don't know if I wanna go to the little hut first, I'm not sure anyway. I mean, auto crossbow is still best to use for this. I guess I could use magic with terror, but there's no need. And I don't know why I didn't save. I'll save state and do a game state save thing. What do we an idiot? Save. Right, there we go. Uh, that one. Let's go up here first. Go to the little hut. <coughs> he meets an old man, I believe. I'm not sure, I don't remember. No, hmm, what's that smell? And I think you can just rest freely in here. Yeah, you can. I think you get a cutscene. I don't remember though. I don't know, anyway. This tea, it was his favourite. So you could be talking about Sabin there. Mm. These dishes, they're just like the ones he always used. Oh, idiot. Didn't realise it'd be like that with all of them anyway, yeah. I think that's it. Nothing there anyway. And then when you go to leave... Could Sabin be living here? <gasps> dun, dun, dun. And then this old man comes in. As I said. Hey. Do you happen to know where I could find the man who lives here? Sure do. Left a couple of days ago. As soon as I heard Master Duncan had been killed, headed up to the mountains. They say Duncan's son Vargas is missing too. I don't like it one bit. So there we go. Found out some intel. And I mean, I can stay out here to uh, fight all this. But I don't think there's any point. Let's use fire on you. Auto crossbow on you to get rid of you. Because I don't actually remember how much experience you get for doing this. Oh god, the muse didn't die, that's not good. Attack you again then. Auto crossbow you too again. That should kill you. Yep. Should be ready for death now. Yep. You get quite a bit. But, you know, there's no need to do that anyway. 987, that should do. I said should do, but you know, anyway. Do 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 See if you actually follow that man you can talk to him. Very mysterious man. Believes that yeah he's here. Right, ignore us and maybe we'll just disappear. Back off lock. That guy looks familiar, yeah, that's him alright. So he's one of these characters that um, eventually you have to pay him money um, for him to join you. Like, he bunks on and off. But anyway, he comes and goes like the wind, swearing allegiance to no one. Hidden behind his wintry gaze lies a face known to none who live. So yeah, Shadow. Hey, that's Shadow. He's an assassin. He'd kill his own best friend for the right price. Guess we'd better steer clear of him. For now, of course. Anyway, well, this is one of the big towns. You now you always get like a big town. It's not as big as some of the big towns you can get, like um, Final Fantasy IX. What is it? What's the town where you get the festival? I don't remember, but I'm sure certain, a certain someone will mention it. But yeah, anyway. Lovely. Oh yes, you've got the sick one over there. 
go see to him, because why not? Oh yes, you can start to get relics as well. I don't know if you got a curse all stood up to the Empire. Great, now we'll be drawn into this. Oh, what a shame. Well, it would be a big shame, actually, but you know. Right. You can gain all kinds of abilities by equipping relics. These shoes double my walking speed. And then you crash into walls. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, don't need to know this. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. So I don't actually remember what relics you get. That's a sprint shoes. Obviously that doubles walking speed. Um, prevents darkness, no. Prevents poison, no. Prevents petrification, no. Knights code causes the bird to cover critically wounded allies. Why not? And then get one sprint shoes. Don't really need anything else. Because obviously sprint shoes can be given to, well, only need to be given to one. And that's the one that you'll be uh, moving with anyway, sprint shoes. Knight's Code. He's the strongest, I think, out of everybody, I'm not sure though. Anyway. Right, you're all fine for now. <clears throat> but I think I should be able to get some equipment um, here now though. Like start being able to buy stuff from Z shops. And look at that. I think I believe this is the port. Yep, there's not really much I can do here yet. I'll be using that port soon though. Because eventually you get this bit where you get three scenarios. I should be starting it next episode actually. Because it triggers after the the well the dungeon after you go to the returners camp. Anyway. That's the item shop. I'm not too bothered about that yet. I just need to go around here. Item armor shop. Or weapon and armor shop, sorry. Really? Oh, I don't know, anyway. No, not 11. Jesus. Too much. I keep on forgetting it's left and right, not up and down. Anyway, Kemp. Cotton robe. Boom. Kempo G. There we go. Boom. Tell me to go see the, uh, uh, tell me to go see the, uh, oi. <clears throat> anyway, now I can sell all the stuff I don't need, so buckler, get out of here, get out of here. It's always good to, you know, free space, you don't have to continuously, like, go through a lot of stuff anyway. Yeah, that's it. <clears throat> sort that out, there we go. Right, now it's time for weapons. I should have enough at the moment, though, anyway. So you can get that, and obviously you have to get the Mithril Sword, will lock, um, and then Noise Buster Bio Blaster. Yeah, I'm not bothered about that. <coughs> Only Auto Crossbow, really. There we go. And then now, obviously, I can sell all this lovely stuff. Go. So just to quickly make sure, great sword, mithril sword, great sword. I forgot that I didn't actually need to buy that mithril sword for lock, but whatever. I have enough at the moment, so it's fine. Um, but yes, I think that's it for now. I mean, I can go in here, but the next time I come here, which will probably be next episode, because I'll do the first scenario first. <clears throat> we'll probably be the first thing. Anyway, actually, no, I might get the elixirs from around the back. Or the elixir. I mean, I actually will be taking that shortcut because <clears throat> you don't just simply walk around the town um, when you come back here, but I won't ruin it, of course. But yeah. Um, I can go upstairs, as I said, but there's no need. Right, everybody's fully healed, yes. Time to go to the chocobo pen. Or the chocobo stable, whatever it is. Yeah, take me on a chocobo ride. Yeah, I know, mate, I know.
There we go. Bum ba bum bum bum. You gotta love that anyway. I guess I'll save state. Now I've done that. Time to get over for Mount Colts. Save it, save it. Lovely, 987. <clears throat> right. This can be dangerous. If I'm not careful. But there is a save point just before the uh, boss battle. I'm not going to say what the boss is because it... Well, yeah. I'm not saying any more, but yeah, anyway. Don't, I don't remember what one I want to be going to. I'll change the save slot too because I don't know if I want to be going up first or not. Anyway, Serpius. So as you can see, these are actually stronger, but not in terms of health, but in terms of damage. I don't remember what way I should be going first. Anyway, Zagrem, all lovely. All dead. Save because I don't know if I want to be going here yet. Uh, yes, I think this is the way I want to be going first. Poor guy, it's lovely. Tools. Gore, oh no, that's not a lovely move to be hit by. I believe it's just a counter attack from when you do like a physical attack. I'm not sure though, anyway. <clears throat> I believe you go around here, don't you? Yeah. Right, well, that is the way to go, never mind them. Let's go this way first then. I don't actually remember what way, what you get going this way, but anyway. Oh dear. Let's steal from him, shall we? Cure. Bam. I oh, didn't use his big move. That's good. <coughs> right, there we go. I don't know if you want to say it is Gorgias or Gorgias or Gorgeous. I've no idea. Really? Oh. Never mind. It was a good idea to come here first. Ignore me. Right, auto crossbow. Attack. <clears throat> you see, I don't actually want to use um, thingy. Magic with terror, because I want to try and keep that magic for healing. Or the MP for healing, sorry. Anyway, I guess it's time to heal. That will do for now. Looks like I could actually do the return a uh, bit as well, <coughs> and then you get Terra gets a decision to make, and then I'll do that, and then I'll leave it when you get to the next dungeon. It doesn't actually look like it's going to take as long as I remembered. Anyway, crap! I should have attacked. Um, each different trillium. Never mind. Travis trillium. <laughs> so funny. I don't know why I said that. Ignore me. I, I, I shouldn't have said that. That's just no. Disgraceful. Anyway, tent. Lovely. <clears throat> if things get sticky, I can use that at the safe point. Oh God, this looks lovely. You leave me no choice. Screw it. Stop the potion, whatever. Bam. Dead. Tools. Shouldn't use gore. And then attack. Dead. I was smart. Anyway. I'll do. Hang on, how much MP have I got? 
Ah, should be fine. <clears throat> As I said, well, I don't know if I actually said on the video or not, but the first few dungeons are quite short. Anyway. Oh, dear. I mean, I don't actually really want to rush with Final Fantasy. You know? Because before I was doing long videos. <clears throat> but, you know, there's no need. Anyway, I'll make you do that. And then tools. Boom. Auto crossbow. Bam, bam. That's that one dead. Bam. No gore, though. No gore. There we go. Do I want to risk... Going, yeah, why not? Let's risk it. We'll save it next time. I don't remember if the next bit you go outside is the bit before. Or not. Crap, let's do it that way. Let's attack that one. <coughs> it's obviously attacking them from behind. <coughs> Deals more damage. Oh. Right now, I definitely will need to heal. There's nothing clever about this now. I guess I didn't actually need to do that. <coughs> I could have just healed Edgar. Whatever. Oh, there's another chest there. Oh, I think I missed that at the beginning. Because you could have went down in that in the first cave area. It's fine. <coughs> Hopefully it's nothing too important. Well, that would be too important. It'd probably not in like a potion, obviously. I'd have liked to have got it, but I forgot about it now, so it's too late. It's too late to apologize. It's too late. <coughs> oh dear, I think I've actually got a sore throat coming, which isn't very good, is it? Anyway. If I get locked to level 10 and Terra to level 9 by the time I reach the boss, that would be l -l 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 lovely. Oh wow, I'm actually close to the boss. I, I thought that was the last outside area before. Anyway, I guess I can save state there, why not? There we go. Bum, ba -da -bum, bum, 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 bum. Go up, there we go. Got a bit stucky, stucky. Icky, sticky, wicky. Trillium, right. So, terror attack that one, lock attack that one, and then obviously auto crossbow both of them ones. Because why not? Lovely. Right, so there we go. Lovely. And again. Of course, auto crossbow. And then attack that one. Oh dear, poisoned. Well, that's lovely. I've got poisoner though, so it's fine. <coughs> I don't think... Well, actually, no. I might have been poisoned by this when I did it before. I don't know. I don't really remember. Anyway, how much is it? Three. Oh, that's fine. Right, let's cure, I guess. I've got enough for five more cures. It's getting a bit close. Anyway, well, Terra's on level nine. I just need Locke to be on level ten now, and I'm fine. Oh, God. Wait, where do I go? <sighs> Down or up? <sighs> ah, let's get. Let's save those few steps, shall we? Trillium, Gorgius, and Serpius. Lovely. Right, so, Auto Crossbow. And then terror attack the trillium. Just get that out of the way. Do you know what? Steal from that bitch. Let's see if I can get another potion. Oh, yes. <clears throat> and then one, one normal attack should be enough to defeat him. Oh, no, never mind. I guess the level ups have made that capable to be done like that. Ah, here he is. Vargas. And he's blocking the way, I wonder why. Ooh. Oh, this battle again. Oh, lovely. I always get this battle in this uh, room or area, whatever you want to call it. I've got to be careful. Ow, 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 ow. What? Oh my god, I was going to say, I thought the critical didn't actually deal enough. Then. Anyway. That should be enough. Uh, I've only got enough for three more heals though, that's the only problem. 
Ah, so close. Let's just battle again, though. That's the problem. I know what I'll do then. Steal from you again. Tools. Auto crossbow. Ah, I couldn't steal. It's fine, though. Stuff it. Attack, attack. Neon. Boom. Boom. There we go. Right. Let's save it. And heal up one last time. I've got enough for two heals in battle. And out of battle, but yeah, anyway. Sabin sent you, didn't he? So yeah, he's like good in karate. Anyway, who are you? Sabin, is he here? You were the one sneaking around us the whole way up here, weren't you? And if I was... <laughs> well, it doesn't really matter who you are. I've got no plans to surrender. Woe is the day you met me. It'll be the last day of your lives. Yeah, you got Ipu and Vargas. Stuff it. I'm gonna have to use magic. To take out the Ipu. Auto crossbow. And this is where it gets hairy, though. Hairy Mary, quite contrary. Oh no. I'll get going. Cure. Right, here we go. It's just Vargas left. I've just got to get to a certain point and then something happens during the battle. These type of boss battles, I wish that I had the drill already, but it's fine. I mean, that still does quite a bit. Crap. Whatever. Just attack the hell out of him. As long as I survive, it's fine. Do 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 do. Come on. Enough of this. I'll send you all to the great beyond. Which is obviously hell. That's enough, Vargas. Ah, if it isn't Sabin. Why, Vargas? Why do you kill Master Duncan? How could you kill your own father? The fool snubbed me, his only son. He chose you as his successor. That's not true. Our master, it's true and you know it. It's written in that ugly sneer across your face. He wanted you to be his successor, not me. He knew you had the most potential. I'm sick of listening to your lies. I've got far more than just potential. Why don't you see for yourself? Blizzard Fist. Oh dear. That's not good. But of course, he's trained against that. Ah, Sabin. My father was right to see so much in you. I guess there's no avoiding this. Fate must made us train together. Now fate will send you to your doom. Doom Fist, right. Because it's the tutorial of Sabin's move, I'll do this just in case. Well, I shouldn't get it wrong anyway. Left, right, left, bam. Raging fist. You're dead. You already learned that technique. Vargas, if only you hadn't been so consumed by pride. There we go. There's actually a tutorial for that, but you can do it before. Anyway, Sabin. Brother? Brother? You're his twin brother? His brother? At first I thought you were another one of Vargas... Vargas' bears. <laughs> oh dear. You thought I was a bear? I guess I'll uh, take that as a compliment. Anyway, Edgar, what are you doing here? We're on our way to the Sabre Mountains. To the return of Hideout, no doubt. So, the wheels are finally turning. I've been watching from a distance, hoping the world would come to its senses. The way things were going, I was afraid Figaro would end up as a puppet state. A means of striking back his presented, has presented itself. There will be no more playing lapdog to the Empire. I'm through with that act. 
think a bear like me could be of any help? You join us, Sabin. I think Duncan would rest easier knowing his training helped bring peace to the world. Well then, let's get going. Hell yeah. Well, I guess I'll save again. So yeah, if all of these, bar lock, are actually three of the final four characters that I'll be using. Anyway, stop attacking Terra, you bitch. I'm gonna have to use potions. Ah, oh, I'll have to do. Not abilities, potions. Bam bam, that'll do. Bam bam, Bigelow. I mean, I'm literally right outside, but I've got to get to the return hideout first anyway. Round, here we go. It's not too far up. I mean, I've actually explored quite a lot of the first continent now, but anyway. So, yeah, just to show you, saving you know, the blitz technique, you've got that. You can actually hell some big enemies, it's quite funny. And then you've got aura cannon. So, yeah, right, left, up, down, uh, down, up. Even though it's an emulator, they're not too difficult to, um, like, do and use and stuff. But, yeah, anyway, I've made it here in 31 minutes. Wow, quicker than I thought. Don't, I don't know if I want to do the bit after this, though, anyway. Blitz. The only thing is, Blitz is random. So is Cyan's, um, Bushido moves. But yeah, Cyan's the fourth member I like to have in my final party. And in most of the parties. But I mean, I will be using the other characters when it comes to... Um, using Espers so that they get the abilities. But most of them I won't be getting them up until, like, right near the end of the game. Anyway, it'd be nice if you could get that Unseely again. But we'll see. Uh, whatever, it's fine. Do 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 do. I believe this can use wrench. But yeah, anyway, there we go. Seems these ain't that bad, but I'll use the potion because you know twelve health isn't good. Anyway, Holly Turner's hideout, and I believe there's nothing really up top either. Here we go. This way, please. Well, because because of the king of it, whatever. Anyway. So yeah, this is a uh, heavily, well, this is heavily story based. This bit coming up, um, and yeah, oh, what are you doing? There we go. So it didn't actually take that long to get here, surprisingly. Anyway, there we go. Level nine. Mm, I guess that'll do for now. Anyway, here he is, Banon. Banon, we brought her with us. So, this is the girl, the one to whom the Esper responded. Esper? It seems the Empire had complete control over her. Carrier pigeons have kept me informed. I also heard that she wiped out 50 Imperial soldiers in mere minutes. No, that's not... Terra. For heaven's sake, Bannon, the girl doesn't remember anything. Hiding from the truth won't change it. Perhaps you've heard this story before. Once, when people were still pure and innocent, there was a box they were told never to open. But someone went and opened it anyway, unleashing all the evils of the world. Pride, envy, greed, wrath, gluttony. The only thing that remained in the box was a single ray of light, hope. I guess they could have added the other two sins as well, because, you know, they were five of the seven, but never mind. Your power is a gift, not a curse. No matter what happens, you must remember that. You are this world's last ray of light, our final hope. Bannon. I've grown weary with the hour. Allow me to rest for a while. There we go. I don't actually remember if it's just now or she doesn't even like heal up. I think it does eventually though, but anyway. Can I get to that? I don't think you do. No, you don't. Anyway, you can talk to all the characters. That's a good idea. The Empire stole someone important from me. I've hated it ever since. If no one stands up to the Empire, more people will be left like me. 
That's why I joined the Returners. But there's no one important in my life. I have no family, no friends. That's not true. And besides, I'm sure there are people who feel you're important to them. Those people are counting on you too. Heck yeah. Anyway. Let's go up here. I don't remember if there's really anything in here. Anyway. Please have the courage to join us in battle, yeah, but, you know. So yeah, Terra has the decision to make. Air knife. Phoenix down. Knight's code. Antidot. Anti fur. You know which tricky. So you actually get like this kind of escort mission with the next thing, and if and Bannon joins you, and if he dies, it's game over, and it can be annoying to like keep him alive. But yeah, anyway, I don't know what to tell you, but I do know that I trust my brother completely. He's always thought of my needs before his own, ever since we were little. I think you should trust him too. But don't tell him I said that. He'll turn red as a tomato. So as you can see, Sabin loves to have a laugh. I mean, what? That's like he's laughed like twice now. Anyway, I guess I'll save it here. Grab that chest, high potion, lovely. It's not easy asking so much of you, and if we force our ideas on you, we're no different from the Empire. So we want you to decide for yourself. Isn't that good? Yes, it is. Well, of course, you get to make the decision. Apparently, something happens if you say no. I'm going to test that out. Ooh, green cherry. That gets rid of Kappa status, I believe. And it, oh, I should have done this first. Idiotus Maximus. I'll do it now, though, at least. Rest for a while, yes. Bannon has this healing ability anyway. I can just use that to heal him up. When it comes to it. Anyway, there we go. I think that's it. Pan on, he went outside just a moment ago. There, there we go. Let's go. Have you made your decision? Will you become our last ray of hope? I've heard something does happen if you say no. Let's find out. I see. Wait, is that it? Have you made a decision we've become our last way of hope? I thought as much. Wait, it's changed. Do I keep on doing it? I've heard that something does happen. So, there's really no convincing you. Ah! Ooh! Hope! How could anyone put their hope in me? So this is a little bonus scene. I guess, like, Terra feels insecure. I, I didn't get this last time, but I was told to do this. Anyway, hope. How could anyone put their hope in me? I like these little hidden things, you know. What's wrong? What's happened? So, yeah, this is... The same it happens, but a diff bit different. Anyway, those those wounds look awful. Self Figaro, the, the, the Empire's taken Self Figaro. They're headed this way, so they found us. We haven't a moment to lose. Lock. I know someone has to sneak into Self Figaro to slow down the enemy, right? This is right up your alley. We're counting on you. Terra, wait for me. I won't be gone long. And watch out for a certain lecherous young king who shall remain nameless. The guy moves in like a hawk. Lock. <laughs> so he knows what he's like. Edgar, old habits die harder. What about us? We can escape down the left river and make our way to Nash. I'm curious about that esper they found in the mines. Very well, already be already the raft by the back entrance. It's risky, but we don't have much of a choice at this point. It's not safe here. Come with us to Nash. It could be a chance for you to gain a better understanding of your abilities. We are no time to dilly dally. Let's make for Nash. I understand your apprehension, but too many innocent lives are being lost to the Empire while we stand here and do nothing. Please lend us your strength. This relic will help keep you safe. 
don't actually remember if you get that before. Maybe the little secret. Well, that little bonus secret. For denying him three times. Anyway, the left river. Oh, lovely. Hang on, what if I heal first in the inn? I want to rest first. You know? Boom, 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 boom. Dun, 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 dun. Let's rest in the inn first. Yes, rest for a while, please. Please do. You know, 40 minutes ain't too bad. I did get up to this point. Yeah, I guess I'll leave it at the left river. I don't actually remember if once you go through the thing, it does it. Anyway. I don't actually remember if you can actually go outside and, like, do a bit, do a few battles if you wanted to. For, I don't know, anyway. Right. Really of right state, yes. Here we go, the Rascal Chorus to Nosh. So, yes, I'm not going to do this yet because... Um, it's like an auto bit that goes along and then sometimes you get to choose a direction and you get battles automatically and you can't actually heal between them and stuff so it's like a little mini challenge but anyway I will be doing this in tomorrow's episode but until then thank you for watching this episode of my playthrough of Final Fantasy 6 Advance and I'll see you in the next episode when I go through the left river and an event will happen which causes me to do the three events that you can actually do in any order. And I'll probably start with the lock event when he goes to South Agoro. And then I'll do the other event that I'm not going to mention because it will spoil what happens here. But obviously that will be till tomorrow. I don't want to spoil too much. So as I said, thank you for watching. And with a massive thumbs up, all I've got to say to you now is goodbye and good night.